Well, here's what this looks like. It's now about 2 o'clock on Sunday. And again, that looks like this. It's really slushy now. I'm not touching it because my hands are going to get cold anyways. I'm going to take the snowblower out. I'm supposedly going over to Cannon's in a little bit. But until he sends me a text message, I'm going to try to clean up this mess. Okay, Big Dirty did the job pretty well. You can see it's been packed down by tires though because I came in late last night and they went somewhere earlier today. But uh, it's windy, so that makes it really fun because then you get pelted with the snow you're blowing as I go north down my driveway. Bitch. Quite a nice little bit of snow. It's supposed to be 41 and sunny tomorrow, so this is going to turn to slush real quick and just make the roads hell for the next week. It's going to be great. But, you know, it is the end of February. This is, uh, this is one of the last substantial snowfalls that we'll have that will last for more than a few days, and that is good news. And I got this, this stuff, you know, the glaciers, at least they're coming off. This thing's been melting down all night. I don't know what the temperature in here is, but it's cold outside. It's like uh, 18, 19 degrees, one of those horrible numbers. And uh, that's, that's still pretty bad. So we'll have to warm this thing up today, get it out and blow this crap off. All right, buddies, 310, pulling over to Mr. Kennan's house. Looks like he's been uh, doing his, his yard works, this, or his snow works this morning, like I have. He may have done a better job down at the... Don't tell him I said that. Seatbelt's a good thing first. Yeah, that's right. If there's anything in drive, team to have to teach me anything. Oh, it starts too. <laughs> yeah, there we go. <laughs> the Michael Baisden show. How's it feel? She feels good. Tell us what we have here. Got a sale. 01 525 with a 5 speed, which is really hard to find. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, 143,224 miles. Wait till you see the exterior. This yeah, is obviously. Go, we'll go down here. All right. You want to oh, park it in by those houses? We'll get some pictures there. That'll look nice. All right. So, 01525, if you didn't hear him, with the five speed. Um, really clean. Heated steering wheel. It's got the sports package with sport wheels and whatnot. And uh, one pixel out there, and it doesn't have the high OBC, so that means less pixel issues to deal with. Um, obviously, the gray Montana leather interior with the, what's the wood? Search with a V. I think it's what Bobby has for the, the wood interior. Uh, minor things need to be replaced, such as that. That's a $10 part, and he's going to replace this with an M shifter and such. Look at that color. Do tell. It's beautiful. The topaz blue is, is really nice. Topaz blue metallic. It's going to get its headlights washed, or uh, the treatment that Colt did with it. Um, those are the sport wheels in 2001. Mm -hmm. Love the color, though. I can see some shadow line trim going on there in the future. It's going to look nice. A couple of things on the back he's going to touch up regarding the center badge is has obviously been polished a bit too much. <laughs> and then the 525 badge will be replaced. Trunk lid spoiler in the future, maybe? Yes. Yes, good. That's going to look really nice. What else do you have to say? What other, what do you have? Yeah, uh, no, a lot of plans? cosmetic things. Nothing mechanically wrong. Check yeah. engine lights off. No check engine light. That's big with this, with these. And um, the, the wheels are in good shape, too. We couldn't find any, uh, any curbing, at least any substantial curbing, which is very good, considering that a woman did drive this car. Usually they're pretty bad. Cheeky, the camera guy here. It is really cold. It is really cold. But look how well these colors complement each other. I actually prefer the dark, but yeah, it looks very, very nice. He's going to have the white halos too in the future, I'm sure. Very soon. Very soon. You can see the difference, though. Wonder how cheeky this is going to be in post tonight when I when I get a look at it. Try right, two hands. Okay, photo shoot is over. I am now uh, going to head back to my house and we're going to go to dinner with my mom's mom. And I don't know what's going on tonight, but oh, that thing looks nice in my beer. I'll have him catch up a little bit here at the stop sign. Yeah, 
That reminds me of when Bobby's was in my mirror what, two weeks ago now, and I've got too much ice on the windshield, you can barely see it now, but it looks so good. Headlights off, now just halos, looking excellent. Yellow, welcome back. We had our dinner. Dinner was very good. We ate at this place called O Charlie's in Cuyahoga Falls. I had myself some fish and chips. Everybody thinks I'm going British and turning into Jeremy Clarkson. Well, so be it. Anyways, going over to Kevin's house. I think we're going to take the 525 uh, out for another. I almost said 540. 525 out for another spin. And um, you know, we'll try to film him screw up this time. I couldn't before. He's actually doing really well with the manual. Of course, he's had a license now for a long time, but. Um, he's driven manual transmission cars before, but it does take some time to get used to it, and every car is different, even if they're automatics, you know that. Steering, braking, suspension, accelerating, every car is different. So, I'm going over there now, and we'll see what shenanigans we can get ourselves into on this beautiful Sunday night. It's 18 degrees. I do have classes tomorrow for Memorial Day. No big deal. They're the two easy ones that don't take a lot of time, so it's actually okay with me. We're at 1,020 feet, 18 degrees Fahrenheit. That's right, with the Mark IV navigation, you now get to know my altitude. How cool is that? You see it? Yep. That's an E39 in Kennan's garage. I knew it was going to happen. It's just a matter of when. And it looks damn good, too. There we go. We're just going to take another quick run around the block. Better get the uh, dash clutch and such. Clever rhyming. Like that kind. Hey, what's up, guys? It is 3:15 in the morning, which is great. Tomorrow's President's Day. Unfortunately, I do still have classes attending a public university, uh, but that's only th th 12 to 3:30, so it's not too bad. Mondays aren't bad. It's 3:28 in the morning, actually. Um, today was a great day. You saw Kenan's car. Congratulations. That's an awesome car. It's an 01. We already talked about it. 525 with the manual, uh, sport, premium, cold weather packages in, uh, what's the name of that color? Topaz blue metallic. Oh, that's a beautiful color. I really like, really love the color with the gray interior. It's a beautiful car. Um, he's been practicing that. You know, he knows how to drive a manual. He drove, I think, a Mazda, the Miata, what is it, RX-5, MX-5, 8, whatever that is. He drove that a while ago. His uncle taught him how to drive it. Then he's driven um, a 330 with the manual and maybe something else in the, in the meantime. But yeah, it's really exciting. I haven't imported any of the other clips yet. I think today's day 798, but that's going to be done soon. So I was over there with him today, working on that. It doesn't really need a lot of work, mostly just cosmetic stuff. The rear badging, uh, a shift knob, a couple pieces of wood on inside have minor cracks in them. It's not a big deal. Fog lights out. He's going to replace the halos and the fogs and stuff with 6000K. It's going to be beautiful. Uh, when nicer weather gets here, it's going to get the Zeno treatment, and that is going to be a gorgeous car, especially in the future with uh, M wheels and uh, M bumpers and stuff on it. It's going to look amazing. So I need to get up and take a shower and get to bed, get ready for the week. It's a short week for most of you people. Uh, I get Friday off, as usual, which is nice, so it should be pretty decent. But uh, it is already February. Today is the 18th. Holy crap. Holy crap. I mean, we're down in here in the in the third row, we've only got a couple more days left in February, another week and a half, which is great. And then we're into March, and good things start happening in March. Uh, Cleveland Auto Show next Saturday, that should be awesome. Um, so I look that, have that to look forward to, and I'll talk to you guys in tomorrow's vlog. don't think I left anything untied. I just talked to Colt for a while, filled him in with, the, uh, with Kenan's new car. And that's it. I'll talk to you guys on Monday. Thanks for watching. Sleep well. Good night.